Mohawk College is a leader in training students for a career in chemical engineering with state-of-the-art equipment and education to provide students with everything they need to know for a career in the field. This machine is called a UV Vis Spectrophotometer. So basically this machine can analyze samples using ultraviolet and visible light. So ultraviolet light is the light that is just above our visible like spectrum that we can visibly see with our naked eye. Um, what it does is basically analyze samples either qualitatively, so for their structure and their composition, or quantitatively, so you can analyze also the composition of a sample and just how much of something is present. So let's say you want to know how much salt is present in a sample or how much heavy metal ion is present. You can use this to give you a very accurate and precise reading. Mohawk graduate Trisha Ranson describes how the GCMS gas chromatography mass spectrometer works. It works, it separates, identifies, and quantifies mixtures of gases or volatile liquids. So I could take a vial of a mixture, don't know what it is, we put it in, analyze it, and everything comes out here, tells us exactly what's in the mixture, what quantities is in the mixture, and just about any information you can get on any chemical in that mixture. Another important machine in the lab is the bioreactor. It is a three component system consisting of a vessel, a bio console, and a control panel. Well, basically what we do is you add all your components to the reactor vessel and you turn it on and the controller determines how to or which substances to add to it, your acids and your bases, and it ferments your product in there to create production of ethanol. This is HPLC, which is the high performance liquid chromatography. This machine is used to separate the organic compound from a liquid mixture. In order to find it, we need to identify the compound based on the retention time. There are so many different applications for this HP this instrument such as chemical, environmental, bioscience, pharmaceutical, well as the consumer product. Some equipment, like the auto titrator, is both crucial and as easy to use as pressing a button. This is an atomic absorption and emission spectrometer. Uh, it can analyze solutions of, we'll say, metals. Metals absorb and emit light. So this can test both. Uh, it looks at the concentration of metals in solution. Uh, the light that's absorbed or emitted is proportional to the concentration in that solution. The students of this program are getting a unique opportunity to work on equipment that is found in the industry. This is even better than what they're using in the industry, to, to be perfectly honest. This is the, the best instrument in this lab, but uh, it's, it's a lot more technical than you actually see in industry. So it's nice to, to be able to work on something like this and then go out and see how lucky you are. <laughs>